Hello everyone, it's Carly and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome, hello, thank you so much for stopping by. My channel recently had a bit of a growth spurt, which I'm super excited about. It's so fun to see my channel continue to grow and gain new subscribers and just build our community even more. If you haven't subscribed yet, pause the video, hit that red subscribe button, give this video a big thumbs up, leave a comment down below. I would love to interact with you, get to know you down in the comment section. And yeah, it's just been so fun and I, I really appreciate you guys who are taking the time to support me. So thank you guys so much for those who have subscribed. It means so, so much to me. And let's just carry on with the video. Okay, I wanted to sit down um, and just talk you guys through my favorites. I don't even remember the last time I did a favorites. But it's been a while and I've been obsessing over so many products and you know new trends coming out. Like it's just been a lot of fun. So I thought I would just sit down and talk you guys through them. I'm in such a good mood today that I was like, I need to document this because I don't know, not that I haven't been in a in a good mood, but like I I don't know. I just have been all over the place. So yeah, I just wanted to like chat, you know, have some fun with my friends on the internet and talk about all the things I love. Okay, I have a couple um products to show in like each category and I can kind of get a bit chatty so I'm gonna try to keep it to very short straight to the point I think I'm gonna start with beauty products they have the most in beauty um, the first thing that I'm gonna talk about is my wet and wild photo focus coconut 3-in-1 priming water this stuff smells incredible and I think that's one reason why I really love to use it like I look forward to spraying it in the morning but I really love the way that it just primes my skin like I really love a nice base for my foundation and then I also um, set this I reset my whole face with this as well after my makeup and I haven't had any problems like with the sprayer leaving like splotches on my skin or anything like that like it's just a nice even just a what was that word it's a nice like even distribution is that a word distribution you know like it just sprays evenly all over my skin um, and yeah I haven't had any problems with it the only thing is like I feel like it's such a small amount of product for a spray I wish it was just like here you know um, but that would be my only like bad thing about this this is my second one that I've already gone through I really really love it the next thing is this elf 16 hour camo concealer so I was really excited about this because my sister told me that this stuff is like such a dupe for the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and so I went out weeks ago to go get it thinking that it was already out or something I don't know and I picked up a random elf one then I realized that wasn't the correct one so then I found this one at um, a Walmart close to me and I love this I will say the only thing that I don't like about this is I need to go a shade darker because this one is a little bit too white and it's like so brightening like if I were to put it under my eyes and just like conceal it's a little bit too bright for me so I need to switch out my shade but I love the consistency I love the wear of it I think it's such a great dupe for the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and it's five dollars so that's like my favorite thing ever I love the drugstore and I love a cheap product that works really well and this really really does um, but yeah I would just be a little bit careful of the color that you go for this is fair warm and it is way too fair for me like I don't really like that super brightening look so I just need to switch this out but yeah it's it's so good I love it okay my next two products are lip products because I actually got a lot of questions in my what's in my bag video about um, the lipstick combo that I was wearing and I mentioned it in my last vlog but for those of you that may not have watched it I just thought I would throw it in here as well. Um, so this is the combo that I've been wearing. The lip cream that I have been wearing is the Matte um, Beige Babe Lip Cream. This is from Maybelline. Yeah, it is from Maybelline and I absolutely love it. I wear this every single day and it is the perfect nude shade. Like I cannot get over how much I freaking love this. And then on top of it, because in the spring and summer I really like to have like glossy lips and just like a very wet lip. And so I've been using the NYX Butter Gloss and this is in the shade Creme Brulee. So these two together are like the perfect match me in heaven. I'm wearing them right now, but to be honest, I just got off of work, so I don't really know what my skin looks like or what, I just turned on my camera. But yeah, these are my go-to. So Maybelline and NYX have been such winners for me. 
Um, I think I'll just breeze through hair care really quickly because again, I talked about this in a vlog showing you guys kind of like my hair routine or what products that I use and I am out of this stuff. I freaking love this stuff. So this is the SGX NYC Salon Graphic, uh, the Do It All Spray. So it's a dry texture spray and it's so freaking good. I can't remember what the brand is called because I said it wrong. I think it's like IGK. I think it's IGK, um, that like texturizing spray that all the bloggers have that everyone wants. This is like such a dupe for it, I swear. I wear this every single day. I have it in my hair. I have done a tutorial on how I do my buns before that I can link um, somewhere. But I have this in my hair today and it just gives you like such that gritty texture that I didn't think I was in love with, but I actually am obsessed with it. And it's my favorite thing. It like refreshes your hair kind of like as a dry shampoo would, but then it also gives you that grit and that texture as a texturizing spray. And then it's supposed to have like some hairspray, but I, I don't know. I don't really see, like it doesn't make my hair crunchy, which is what I was nervous about when I read like the hairspray part. Um, but yeah, it just it, like, it doesn't leave my hair crunchy. It leaves it still soft and like movable, but nice and gritty you know what i'm talking about like just fluffy i love like those fluffy curls it is i love it moving on to like body care i only have one thing um but i freaking love it so i thought i would just talk about it this is the dove exfoliating body nope dove exfoliating body polish in crushed macadamia and rice milk you guys this is the best freaking scent ever if you want to know what i smell like because i kind of love to know what people smell like smell this because this is exactly what i smell like and it's so good i use this to exfoliate my skin obviously all over the place but i also use this specifically for exfoliating before and after i get my brazilian and it helps so much with ingrown hairs i am obsessed with it and so that's originally why i picked it up but now i go through this so fast because i just lather it everywhere it makes your shower smell so good and it leaves that scent onto your skin which i didn't think i would want because i want to like i am such a moisture person like i need to put lotion on after i get out of the shower and so i normally don't want too many different smelling products but this is so good like i love when i can still smell it on my skin and yeah it's just been like my favorite thing this again is my second tub so i have gone through this and it's like almost out She's got to get another one. But yeah, it's just so good. You can find it. Obviously, it's Dove, so it's easy to find, um, super affordable, and just has been such a go-to and such a staple, especially getting my skin ready to like be exposed for the spring and summer. I think exfoliating is a must. Since we were already on the topic of skin, I thought I would talk about my skincare favorites. The first one is the vitamin E oil from Trader Joe's. I love this stuff. I put one to two drops into my moisturizer every single day. And vitamin E oil I heard is really good for like acne and scarring specifically to help kind of reduce the look of scars. I don't know. I feel like I just, well, I guess I've gone through a decent amount for like an oil that I only use during the day. Maybe not, but I feel like I've gone through a decent amount. I was using it, I got this a while ago, and I actually wasn't even using it regularly until like two weeks ago. So I feel like now is when I'll kind of hopefully start to see um, if it is working for me, but I still just want to give it a try. And yeah, I've heard people swear by it, so like I'm trying to be super consistent. So I'll let you guys know. The reason I put it in my favorites is because it makes my skin feel so good and so glowy. So I don't really know, like, obviously I still have scarring, so that aspect I'm still waiting on, but the way that like it makes my skin look is amazing. I just think there's no better look than looking like oiled up in the summer. I don't know what it is. Like I will put coconut oil all over my body, but I can't put it on my face because like that makes me break out so hard. But for some reason, this has not made me break out. It looks so good. So oily, so dewy, like just, mm, I love it so much. Some people may not want to look oily and greasy. That's totally fine. I get that. Um, and it obviously like dissolves. Like you don't look like that for long. Like once I put on my makeup, my skin has already like 
drank it up, you know? I just love that like initial glow that this gives my skin. And so, yeah, I'm still gonna keep working at this. And I just wanted to shout it out because yeah, I love the way it makes my skin look. I already talked about this before, but this is the Glossier Super Pure Serum. I love this. This is my second one uh, because I bought this in February when I went to New York, so I already went through that first one. To be fair, it is only half a fluid ounce, so that's literally nothing, and I wish it was not that. <laughs> like, I don't understand why it's this freaking small, but it is so worth it. I am obsessed with this. I think it's helped my skin 1,000, 1,000%. I absolutely love it. It hasn't irritated my skin. It didn't break me out. Like, if anything, it's helping that redness because I have, let's see. Yeah, I got it in February, so that's a good amount of time. Um, and yeah, I haven't had anything bad with it. I'm obsessed with it. I think it's definitely helped the redness of my skin, the appearance of my skin, my breakouts. It's so good. I love it. Okay, my last skincare product is actually something I also got in New York. It was recommended to me by Natalia. So thank you, Natalia, because these freaking things are so good. These are the Peach Slices Acne Spot Dots. So I can only find these at CVS, and when I find them, I just snatch them all up. They're so freaking good. So they look like, this is how much I love them. Like there's only three left. I don't know if you can really see, but so they're just these clear dots that you put on like a new spot or a spot that's coming on. Like I'll literally put one right here on my forehead because you see, get this. Look at what this wedding is doing to me. But yeah, so I will like put this on my freaking forehead, for example, tonight and you just leave it overnight they're translucent and when you wake up in the morning the dot is like significantly smaller and like not as red like it just like protects them and heals them these freaking things are so these things are so good i love them i feel like they're like two dollars or something crazy like that so super affordable they come with a lot in the pouch they come with big ones they come with little tiny ones and i just put them on overnight in the morning you just have to remember to take them off and you can like when you, this is going to be gross but when you like take them off you can see like all the yucky stuff that it's been sucking out um and it's been insane i love them sebastian even uses them like he'll steal a couple every once in a while and so yeah, okay, we're on our last category. I have been chatting for quite some time, um, but this is just like food items, um, like non-beauty stuff, and one is healthy, one is not, because that is life. And the first one is my Vital Proteins Collagen Powder. I was so happy because I use this stuff every single day in my coffee. I love this so much. So this stuff is so awesome because it's so freaking good for you and it's made from super simple ingredients. It is good for your bones, it's good for your skin, it's good for skin elasticity, I cannot say that word. Um, hair and nail support, which like my hair needs lots of support. Um, but yeah, just awesome ingredients, it's an awesome company and I just get uh, mine at Target. I think they used to have this at Costco. I could be wrong, but I don't, I don't think they do anymore. Well, I don't know, but I get mine at Target and they have lots of different flavors. So the one that I use every single day in my coffee is just the regular unflavored and that's why I love this. I've seen people put this into soups, into chilies, like anything that's warm that it can just dissolve in. Um, I've seen people use it in. It doesn't have a taste, like it kind of froths up in my coffee, which I kind of like. Um, but yeah, you can put it into anything. Yeah, this was sent to me actually by Vital Proteins. They sent me this amazing box full of all these goodies. Um, wasn't paid to talk about this at all. I just figured, I keep this at work, so I just figured like I wanted to talk about it sooner or later, but I always forget it at work, and now I have a new tub to keep at home, which is really nice. Um, but they sent me that, and then they also sent me their Beauty Collagen, and so this one is a flavor. It is strawberry lemon. It has all the same benefits as the um, original one does, but just has a nice little flavor, and I actually tried it. It's super good. Um, and I like to drink like hot lemon water in the morning sometimes, so this is perfect. You can just throw it in there. It's helping out with the beauty. I don't think there's anything different. Oh, this one, did I say? No, so this one, the lemon strawberry also has like digestive health. It helps with that, which is really good. So yeah, I've seen lots of these different flavors at Target 
They're easy to pick up. They also have a website. They have lots of cool things. So check them out if you're interested. And yeah, thank you so much again, Vital Proteins. That was such an awesome little box to come home to. And it's literally my favorite thing ever. So my last thing is my unhealthy treat. And this, my friends, is the best thing I'm ever gonna freaking tell you. And this is the Starbucks Vanilla Latte Chilled Espresso. Eesh, this is so good. So again, I get this at Target. I've seen it at Walmart. I haven't seen it at Smith's, but so either Target or Walmart. <sighs> this is these like this is my baby. Like I love this. I was doing so good for like two months. I wasn't buying it because I get obsessed with this. So I didn't buy it for a couple months. Then I went to my mom's house. She got this for me, and now I'm freaking hooked again. So. It's so good. I talked about this in my what I eat in a day video, the last video I just put up, because it's so good. This is like my dessert. I'm not really a huge sweet person, so I don't really need to eat anything sweet after dinner, but like, ugh, especially since it's getting warm outside and like the sun is setting way later, I just wanna like sit on my patio with like a nice chilled ice drink and oh, this has been my go-to. So I'll just put an ice, or I'll put ice in a glass, pour this bad boy over and you're set. It is so freaking good and you guys will thank me if you like vanilla lattes. All right, you guys, that is everything on my favorites list. Things I've been loving and obsessing over and trying to get over the habit of. Um, but yeah, I just thought I would share some of those with you. I hope that you guys enjoy. Thank you guys so much for your continuous support on my channel. It means so much to me. I won't ramble any longer. I hope that you guys have a great day and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Yeah.